Everybody, welcome back to what is another sort of hashtag triple M, otherwise known as Moment Monday. So you guys are flipping Moment Monday best is on. The dance show was done. There is only one thing left to do, and you guys know what that is. It's to start the flipping episode. And we are on that like 80, I so, know, uh, we're on a crazy amount. And someone pointed out, we are nearly on Moment Monday 90, which then means we're nearly on Mailman Monday number 100, which holy for Molly, uh, I think I've got something prepared for that, but I'm so excited. But yeah, we're like, we've made so many of these, it's so hashtag great. But yeah, without further ado, let's crack into what part of today's episode. Let's go! Oh my god! What? So the next package you got here? Wait, 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 wait. Is it my phone? Oh my god, my phone's ready. What the heck is so, uh, Sorry, I should have turned it off before I started recording, but hello. Oh, NASA, NASA's calling me again. Why are they, they keep calling? There's an extraterrestrial package in my bed. Are you serious? Where could. I think I got it. I think I see it right there. Appro approach with caution. Alright, yeah, yeah, okay. I'll talk to you soon, alright? There's an extraterrestrial package in my bedroom right there. I'm gonna. Th what the? <laughs> The very first package you got today for today's episode of Hashtag Triple M is a completely like, look at this, it's so reflective, it's like the stuff, I don't know if you guys have this in uh, your country, but like in Australia, if you park your car and it's super duper hot, you put this stuff in like the, uh, what is it, the windscreen, and it bounces the sun off, and there's a whole package made out of it, like reflective sun material, so uh, there could be an extraterrestrial alien being in here, that would be awesome, could you imagine a mail on Monday where an alien abducts me? Okay, it looks like we got an envelope with an envelope. So I finally got the second envelope open right here, and inside appears to be silver flipping Pokemon cards. Oh my, look at this, what the heck, oh my, job one. I'll tell you what guys, the aliens are providing the goods, that's absolutely awesome. Thank you so much for the three different weird packages, we'll open those in a sec, but there's also a message which is not written in alien language, which says, What's up, Ando? My name is Jordan, and I'm a massive fan of all your videos. I've been collecting Pokemon cards, but I can't even remember how long. AKA one or two years, but, uh, <clears throat> you know, it's, it's been a while. I just wanted to send you something for hashtag triple because I love these so much, and thank you so much for making amazing videos all the way from Jordan. P.S. Are you excited for Avengers 8 Voltrox? I'm super excited. Okay, that definitely shows how far behind I'm with mail, and uh, <laughs> that's your question, man, I was beyond pumped up, like, I was gonna go on the uh, day that actually came out, but when I got hit up, asked to go to the Red Cup premiere, I was beyond pumped up, so uh, yeah, the answer, yes, I was very excited. And definitely leave a comment in the comment section below, if you saw the Avengers, what do you think of it, and guys, I read the craziest thing in the world, apparently they're making Avengers number three. Yeah. Okay, we're gonna calm down, I think we're gonna look inside the alien sort of packages, I'm not sure, you might need to get your radiation helmets on, because I don't know, an extraterrestrial being could, like, jump out of these bad boys, but without further ado, Let's take a look at the Pokemon boost back with a Pokemon on the side, a Fionn on the other side, and the most badass looking Pokemon ever, the Thunderous that's a cloud. Whee! So guys, hopefully you plugged in your anti-mind altering devices because I don't know about this card, but it looks like it's from the Motherland, the homeland of the aliens. But then we got a Zero Stick, a Snivy, a Flippin' Zoroa as well, Swoobat doing his swooing little thing, I don't know. Then we got a Fionn, then five Magical's card sleeves out the aluminium boost pack. Spider-Man, Spider-Man, does whatever a spider can. Size. The next package we got here actually comes all the way from Flipping New Zealand. Do we have, actually, believe it or not, we've actually already got a stamp for New Zealand, which is quite epic. It's pretty cool. Look how close it is to Australia. That's pretty epic. Love New Zealand so much. Only been there once in my life and it was like really amazing. So like it was beyond scenic. It was absolutely ridiculous. But check this thing out. It's the Amazing Spider-Man envelope. I reckon this definitely wins the award for the best envelope we've ever got given. And as we spin around, it's got like one of the comic book strips. It's so well, that's like absolutely amazing. As you can see here, Spider-Man's trying to grab him, but obviously his mixtape is way too hot. He's just getting electric shocked everywhere. So inside of Peter Parker's envelope here, we've got What's Up Ando slash Unlisted Leaf. My name is Zach and Tom. Okay, so you've either got two names or there's two different people sending a letter. I'm going to say there's two different people, but what's going on, Zach and Tom? We are all the way from Flipping New Zealand, and we think it's so cool that you can spread happiness all around the world from just you. Thank you so much from Zach and Tom. <laughs> oh, Zach and Tom, that was just too good. <laughs> Emotion in one letter, thank you so much. Believe it or not, they actually sent a couple of drawings as well. Like the absolutely amazing unlisted leaf logo there, that looks so cool. And a Pokeball flipping love heart. This is the most, oh my gosh, emotional felt letter I think I've got in ages. Thank you so much. And to make that one more tear come out, they've actually sent two different cards here, which are absolutely awesome, but check this thing out. It's a penguin on a jetpack. So the first card out of the two different ones that he actually sent us was this awesome looking hollow ho ho. What a mouthful, hollow ho ho. And then we got a amazing Raichu. That looks, I don't know, the artwork looks so cool and the attacks as well, but not as cool as that flipping card sleeve. How cool was that? It's a penguin on a jetpack. So this next package here comes all the way from flipping England, which is like absolutely miles away, but check this out. Not only we've we got the queen on the front, we've actually got, it appears to be like a square or something. Like, look at this. What could that possibly be? It's really cool and it's rattling like really bad. So without further ado, let's crack into the package that has the big square and spiky thing inside. 
So, uh, I think first up here I'm gonna read the letter out because I literally have no idea what that thing is, but I'm gonna try and get some context before I show you guys, because... Yeah, let's do it. What's going on, Unlisted Elite, aka UWL Unlisted. Yeah, that makes sense, fair enough. UWL it is. I'm all the way from the UK and my name is Joel. I'm only nine years old. I've sent you a few Pokemon cards and I know they're not the best, but hopefully you still like them. Keep up the absolutely amazing work from Joel. Okay, there is no explanation as to what that thing is, so I'm just going to show you right now. I'm pretty sure it's like some kind of dog, like that kind of looks like a dog, but it's a square, it's got some QR code on the top, and then it's a pla- it's really squishy plastic as well. But it's just a dot. Can anyone, like, does anyone at all know what that thing is in the comment section below? It may be a key ring, but that's like a really heavy key. Could you imagine this thing in your pocket? That'd be ridiculous. Yeah, definitely leave a comment in the comment section below if you know what that thing is. I have no idea at all. Uh, guys, on the same token, it absolutely terrifies me that he managed to set the one poison MG. Or the one, like, poison damage counter. Why would you send that? But guys, no need to worry because we're all in this together. Da, 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 da. So yeah, last but not least, we've actually got a whole bunch of different cards here we can actually have a look at, which is so many, and like half of them are sleeves as well. That's so cool. Yeah, let's go take a look at these different cards. So right off the bat is this flipping reverse ancient trade bit of looking like an absolute boss. I don't know about you, but bit off, he's just a boss himself. I'll uh, get a whole bunch of other cards, but then finishing off is a custom made March Op EX. Here it is, the final package of today's episode of hashtag Triple M, and it is a massive pack. Like, check this thing out. It's a massive box. It's pretty heavy as well. Look at that thing. It's got some like fat barcode inside. And then we got like, uh, yeah, a couple of rip barcodes. <laughs> R.I.P. the rip barcode. It's all the way from the USA, all the way from Ryan, so shout out to you. Let's crack into this bad boy. And Mrs. Stanley, are you ready? Oh, and I wish I was lying in the beach in Hawaii somewhere. I just read the letter for this package, and it's actually like something a bit different, which is pretty cool. It's actually from a Pokemon club all the way in, uh, in the USA. And the guy that runs it's actually named Ryan, and he calls himself the Water Gym Leader. And yeah, I think they pretty much all gather there, they play Pokemon, and they all watch my videos. So they wanted to send me a package individually, so they've all said like letters. I won't read all the letters out, but I'll show you guys like what they said. First up here is actually something really cool, and I admire this so much, because I know it takes so much effort. We get a Dratini and a Diglett, like handcrafted by Clay. The results are fantastic, they look absolutely really cool. I'm definitely going to have them like right next to my computer, because yeah, they look really cool. And after that, they actually sent a complete like Minecraft paper world kit, which I actually unboxed uh, in one of my videos before. So if you want to see what that looks like, go search that video up for things like Minecraft uh, unboxing or something. Guys, Make sure you're holding your socks on because this is absolutely like ridiculous. Each like individual member of the club has sent me a fully coloured in drawing of a Pokemon. Are you kidding me right now? Is that, oh, it's not the right way. There we go, that's the right way. Like means the absolute world, a whole living club has sent me a package. This would take so long to put together. Oh my gosh, thanks a bunch. And guys, the most like amazing part of this entire letter it's got, for being such an awesome YouTuber and doing what you do, we've decided to upgrade you to the water badge. And then they include this thing. It's a custom made water badge. Oh my gosh, I'm definitely putting that my shirt. That is so cool. Thank you so much. I'm so honored to be in the uh, water badge. That means the absolute world. And uh, yeah, let me just pop that my shirt now. Well, guys, I think I'm off to become a uh, official Pokemon trainer. You know, one badge down, I got the rest to go, and then we're off to uh, beat the Elite Four. What do you guys say? Let's do it. Let's go. Come on. Yeah, that pretty much wraps up the uh, like mystery goodies inside the package here. But we've actually got all these different like individual packages from everyone in the club, and they've all sent some Pokemon cards. So without further ado, I'm going to sort through these bad boys, and let's go take a look at all the different Pokemon cards. Oh my gosh. Guys, I don't know about you, but like trainers always get so underrated. And this literally shows us how cool trainer cards could be. Are you looking at some of these, right? Like, the artwork on those were just incredible. Then we get a first edition Dragonite, uh, a Mew as well, a Zapdos. Feel free to, like, flip and pause this at any time because I completely understand. A Dratini as well. An amazing Giraffe Rig. I didn't even think Giraffe Rig would have that ball of artwork. We've got an Ancient Trait Mew there. How cool is Ancient Trait Mew? Everyone seems to love him. Although he only goes, like, $8-ish or $9 on eBay, which is all in the hood. But to finish it off, is this sick looking trainer card challenge card. Yeah, because that pretty much wraps up today's episode of Hashtag Triple M, otherwise known as Mount Monday. Hopefully you enjoyed it, and if you guys are thinking Android, I'd love to see some packages for Hashtag Triple M. Make sure you send the PO box in the description below, but make sure you do take a picture of it before you do send it, because unfortunately I can't send it back. But most of what you listen, guys, we do have a fantastic week. It's only Monday, so we got the rest of the week to enjoy. But most of all, what do you do? You thump me, I thump you! Oh my gosh, there's a hat. You're going to keep on gaming, right? See you then.